Hey, it's me again. I'm back. All right. So in this little segment, we're going to talk about expanded form. Expanded form is where you take the standard number. And you know, I like to do my hand signs to stick it to my brain. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the standard number, which is just the numbers put together, and you're going to stretch it up. And you're going to add pluses and zeros. So you stretch it up and you add pluses and zeros, okay? So here's the definition of expanded form. Expanded form is where you write it to show the value of each digit, okay? So down here, this number, do you see it has just the numbers? If you remember from a couple of videos, that is standard form. Remember, the numbers are just hanging out by themselves. They like to hang out by themselves, their standard form. So you can see for expanded form, I put what the value of this five was, which was 5,000, what the value of this two was, which was 200, and what the value of the three was, which was 30, and the value of the six was six. So how do I do that? How do I take that little standard number and stretch it out and make it big, and put pluses and zeros? So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my number and I'm going to put it in a house because that's a good tool to help us do lots of neat things. Okay, so here's my number. Look, it's just these numbers hanging out by themselves. So this is in standard form. So I want to put that in a house. So I'm going to write that this is my units and this is my thousands. Okay, so that's going to help me read the number. So now I know it's 52,367. Okay, so I want to know how much is this 5 worth? Well, it's in the thousands house, and it's in the ten thousands. So that 5 is worth 50,000. So one way to do this is to write your 5, and then count how many zeros would you have to put behind it to make it 50,000. Well, you would need one, two, three, four. So I'm gonna write one, two, three, four. And don't forget our comma to show the new period. So remember I said you're gonna stretch it out and add pluses. So the next thing we're gonna do is add plus. Because when we're done, Remember, plus means to add. So I should be able to add all these numbers together and it should bring me back to the standard form. So it's gonna be the total of all these added together, okay? Okay, so my next number is, I wrote this five, so I'm gonna mark it off so I know I'm done with it. I don't accidentally write it again and I'm okay. So now I'm gonna write this two. That two is in the one thousands. So I need to show that that two's value is 2,000. So I'm going to write my 2 and then I'm going to go back and see how many zeros I need to put to make that 2,000. Well, I need to put 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. So that 2 is worth 2,000. Now I can mark that off. Okay, I'm add another plus sign. My next number is the 3. And that three is in the hundred spot. So the value of that three is 300. So I need to show the value down here as 300. So I'm gonna write my three. And then I need to count one, two zeros should go behind that. One, two, 300. Okay, so I'm gonna mark it out so I don't accidentally write it again. Need another plus sign. Ooh, I ran out of room, so I'm just going to pop it down here, and that's okay if you need to jump below, because these numbers get pretty big when you expand them out. Okay, so my next number is 6, and that 6 is in the tens spot, so I need to show the value is 6 tens. So I'm going to write 6, and I'm going to make sure I've got 6 tens. Alright, I'm almost there. Okay, my last number is seven, and it's just in the ones. There's no more places behind it, so there should be no zeros behind this number. It should just be seven ones. 
So now if I were to stack this back on top of each other and I would have to stack it in a house to make sure I got it stacked right and I added it all up, I should come up with 52,000. 367. So I've taken this standard number and I've stretched it out until the value of each place and I put it in expanded form. So it adds back to 52,367. My handwriting's a little sloppy there. 52,367. Okay, so we just went over expanded form. And that's where you take a standard number with just those numbers hanging out, you stretch it out, and you add your pluses and your zeros because you're telling the value of each place.